Got the egg basket? Yeah. Look at that dinosaur. He's everywhere out here. Mm, it's real that big. Yeah, it's chicken double egg. yolk, a double yolk chicken egg. Yeah. They said they got competition with Miss Turkey. They better get to it. Okay y'all, it is like a lot of hours later. We're here at Aldi and as you can see, it's a lot busier than it normally is when we come. Cause I normally try to come, you know, earlier in the day or right after lunch or right before lunch. But yeah, it's 522 today. I was gonna just wait and come in the morning, but we're out of milk and I didn't have to cook supper because we're having the leftover fried spaghetti. So since I didn't have to cook, I said, come on sissy, we go in. Manly wanted to come too, so here we go. Surprisingly, the Aldi find aisle is empty. Oh, look at these little mini waffle makers and a mini griddle. That is cute and they're purple or pink. They're $8.99. Oh, this, I need one of these. People have been losing my storage containers when they take them to work with them and stuff. These are $7.99, a 30 piece food storage set. These knives are so pretty. They are $11.99. They have this kind too, and I think they have a solid green, but I don't see it. They also have these really pretty pans. These are like a light blue. I don't know if it's picking up good. Oh, spring saute pan with lid. They're $27.99. The spring sauce pan with lid is $18.99. Wood and marble recipe stand, $19.99. They have some tablecloths. These are pretty. Some cute striped shoes, $8.99. Oh, somebody done stole some rubber boots. Oh no, there they are. They are $16.99 rain boots. They're really cute. They have dragonflies on them. Can I hold them? They're heavy. Ah! Oh my. I can hold them as a bear. Yeah, like a bear? <laughs> yeah. Silicone square tray and a silicone pie dish. They're $5.99. Glass mixing bowl set, $16.99. This has honey roasted peanuts, pastel candies, white chocolate chunks, graham cracker bites, yogurt, co yogurt covered raisins, and marshmallow bits. And this one, springtime trail mix, has yummy chow, pastel candies, peanuts, peanut butter drops, dark chocolate chips, and mini peanut butter cups. Ooh, Easter pasta. These are so cute, y'all, but the kids do not like these. Like if I make the different pasta shapes, Christmas or Valentine's Day ones. Like those. He says he likes it, but they won't eat it, y'all. They like to look at them, but they don't like to eat them. Oh, look at this springtime coffee collection. Hazelnut cream, coconut, Irish cream, toasted marshmallow. Look how cute they are. Sugar cookie, lavender honey, brown sugar, and mint mocha. Those are so cute. They're $6.99. Here are the pretzel slims. We were gonna get some more of those, but they don't have any regular. They just have the garlic parmesan or bacon habanero. I don't see any regular ones, do you, Cece? Okay, y'all. Y'all told me that this stuff is amazing. The cheese and caramel mix. So we're gonna try it. We've got more coffees down here. Island coconut, cookie dough, Irish mocha. We still have some kiwi. Do we need more pineapple? Um, yeah. Okay, get one, pick one out right there. We still have lots of apples, so we don't need any apples this week. We do need cucumbers, yes. Are they mushy? We need some more carrots. We still have spinach. I don't think we need any spinach. These heirloom tomatoes were really, really good. So we're gonna give these a try. I'm gonna get some cinnamon swirl bread. I found the pretzel slims and they're marked down to 219. Have y'all tried these cheese wraps? They have cheddar and Parmesan. It says wrap it, crisp it, roll it, melt it. They have some new deep dish pizzas. These look really good. smell pancakes? I smell it too. You smell it? I don't know what smells like pancakes. It smells like syrup. Yeah, it does smell like syrup. Where's that coming from? Probably somebody up on top of that mountain cooking pancakes. What you think? Um, yeah. have 
the St. Patrick's Day Lucky Charms marked down to $1.50. Two for three. Titus is out of craft, Thousand Island. That's his favorite. Um, strawberry. Strawberry, you want key lime too? The green yeah. kind? Yeah, okay. I want green. Aldi and Ingalls both went down a penny on their milk. <laughs> We are back home. I'm gonna show y'all the Ingles stuff first. It's like the uh, family request haul, kind of. A lot of stuff in here people ask for. I uh, just got two gallons of milk because since I went so late in the day, there of course were not very many meat markdowns at all. So I'm gonna go back one day this week anyway to try to find some more meat deals. So I just grabbed two gallons and I'll get some more whenever I go back. I got some broccoli. Titus said he doesn't like the broccoli from Aldi, so. I got broccoli from Ingles. I got some sandwich bags, plastic wrap, and tea bags. We've been using these Laura Lynn tea bags for a little while now. We got them when I sent the boys to Ingles to get tea bags one time and Louisiana wasn't on sale. I was like, just get Laura Lynn and it's just as good as Louisiana and the Great Value. Those were our two favorites. We got some pepperoni and mozzarella cheese. The kids have been asking about pepperoni wraps, so that's for that. And I already had spinach here. They like pepperoni, spinach, and mozzarella cheese on them. I got a few of the whips yogurts, two key lime, and two strawberries. Titus requested his craft Thousand Island salad dressing and I got some buttermilk he hasn't been by that local place where we get the fresh milk and cream and you know I use the cream to make homemade butter and butter and get the buttermilk from it he hasn't been there in a while I have all these bottles over here that I need him to exchange but he just hadn't had time to get by there so I just got some buttermilk these Lucky Charms were on sale two for three dollars so just a dollar fifty a box the kids didn't ask for Lucky Charms but they do like them and since they were on sale I just went ahead and got those I mean just because it's the St. Patrick's Day kind whatever they taste the same they did ask for Frosted Flakes and Cinnamon Toast Crunch both of these were on sale for $2.98 Toaster strudels. Jake asked for these. They were on sale three for eight. So I got two strawberry and one blueberry. These, I see that they get these little packs of donuts from gas stations a lot. And Ingles had them on sale for just $1.98 a box. And it comes with eight packs of the three donuts. And I'm sure they're paying like $2, if not more, at a gas station for the little packs they get. So I got the chocolate ones and the powdered ones. Titus asked for this Pepperidge Farm chocolate fudge stripe layer cake. And that's it, that's it from Ingles. All right, and then from Aldi, let's start with the Aldi finds first. These knives, they are so pretty, y'all. So, so pretty, and I didn't even notice it until just now, but they have the little cases with them. The little, you know, protector things that go over the blade. I didn't even notice that. They're so pretty. I got this one, they're white with the little pink flowers and all, and they got me. The peanut butter bunnies got me. They caught me at a weak moment, and I surrendered, and I put them in the boogie. <laughs> and I showed y'all this in the store the 30 piece food storage set. I needed some more oats, so I got some old fashioned ones. The kids, like I was telling y'all in there, love these pretzel slims. They loved them, so I got two bags of those. We got some of the spicy kettle cooked chips and tortilla chips, and this one, the caramel and cheese mix. I'm still a little nervous about it, but an overwhelming amount of y'all, I mean so many of y'all, said that this is very, very good together. So we're gonna try it. Also, this was also the cereal stock up week. I was running really low on cereal. So we got some of those. They're like the Honey Smacks or whatever, but it's the Aldi brand. The kids asked for these. And I remember probably two years ago, it might be like even longer than that ago, I got the name brand of these little bitty soft baked mini fruit bar things. They didn't like them. So we'll see if they like these, but yeah, it's been a long time ago, so they don't remember them. <laughs> I'll let y'all know if they like them. Now they do love these fruit and green bars, the blueberry. So we got a box of those. We got two boxes of the chewy dipped peanut butter granola bars. They are just wonderful. That's what they are. It's like you can pretend that you're eating a candy bar, but it's a granola bar. It's a little bit better than a candy bar. <laughs> they are so good. Uh, I got two packs of butter because like I said, Titus hasn't been by that place to get me the fresh cream that I've been making butter and stuff with. And Aldi had it on sale for $2.49 a pack this week. So I got two of those. We got some cheese dip, salsa. They had two of the crispy pan pizzas. These are like the Motor City Pizza Company pizzas. They only had two, so I got those. Uh, this garlic chicken, it was like $4.45 or $4.50. Ingles has the name brand of the garlic chicken pack. They were on sale two for 10, but this you know, is still cheaper at Aldi and the kids like this just as much. So I got two bags. Two blocks of mild cheddar cheese. And then back there, I got some white 
grape juice and I forgot to get coconut milk. I was going to get some vanilla coconut milk and we were going to use this to make the little refreshers that we love to make during the summertime, but I forgot to get coconut milk. I'll have to write that down and remember it when I go back for meat deals. Um, I got some heavy whipping cream and besides the bread, everything else is produce. I got one loaf of white bread, some of the 12 grain bread and some cinnamon bread, a big pack or a pack of the large big tortillas and a pack of the medium sized ones. Then everything else is produce. We got a pineapple, cantaloupe, lots of tomatoes, many different kinds of tomatoes there. Some grapes, peppers, bananas. I got lemons from Aldi this time. They're not as big. They're still pretty big, but Ingles didn't have lemons on sale this week and it would have been more expensive to get them there. So I went ahead and got these big ones from Aldi, but yeah, they're not as big as they were last week. We got some cucumbers. Two packs of baby carrots, cabbage, some of this spring mix, uh, bell peppers, and onions. And that's it. I'm gonna get the spaghetti out and just be letting it warm up in the oven. Hey, Tyler forgot we had the spaghetti in there and he made a pizza. <laughs> but we have plenty, so if he's still hungry, he can have some spaghetti too. I'm just gonna put it in the oven with some foil over it and let it be warming up while I put all this away, and then it'll be time to eat.